Hey YouTube, hey YouTube, it's me for a thousand me and I am going to talk about cooking this um, episode. Um, yeah, I don't cook much but I am beginning to. Um, what with the economy, the way it is, I don't get to splurge and indulge the way I used to. So, um, I've gotten into cooking, and I think it was by way of a, a tour I did in Chicago, and there's this store that we toured, and it was called the Spice House, and they grind their own spices, fresh spices, you know, they have seven types of cinnamon, I, did you know there were seven types of cinnamon? There's cinnamon from, you know, Vietnam, Indonesia, China, Singapore, never knew. Um, my favorite spice is this spice called Back of the Yards Garlic Pepper Butcher's Rub. Back of the Yards is a um, neighborhood in Chicago. And what I like about all their spices you know, from cinnamon to thyme, oregano, spice, herbs and spices, um, different seasoning salts, um, pumpkin spice. I can go on and on and on. Nutmegs, mace, everything. They sell it by the ounce and half ounce. So you know how, like in like most stores, you um, you have to get it in the big shaker, but this lets you get it like uh, on a as you need basis and fresh spices mean so much like and that's my foray into cooking because you can take some bland potatoes spice it up and um, you got something going and fresh cinnamon you know it got me into you know I'm a brainiac so I then began like spice pairings like I never knew that chocolate when you pair it with cinnamon brings out when cinnamon is in chocolate it just makes the chocolate taste that much better and it just led me to discover you know like I don't know if I'm I'm not a safe eater like I like to try a lot of things but you know, I'll try things that I already know. Like, I love waffles. So now I'm all about, if I put this kind of spice and waffles and these different fruits, I'll have better waffles. And now I'm into making my own ice creams and sorbets. And let me tell you, kiwi sorbet, mmm, mmm. It's good, it's good, it's good. Maybe I'll have to do, like, some videos with me um, doing short you know showing me doing sorbet I don't know but I'm just here to say that the spices that you use if your food is well seasoned with fresh spices you probably will feel full faster that's a tongue twister feel full faster um, I think there's a point in your brain psychologically that has to be satisfied or satiated and if your food is bland you know you could spice it up like I've used some of the oregano's and just put it in like just regular prego spaghetti sauce instantly better you know just do something and that's my I guess my time here I didn't really have a format for how I was going to talk about fresh spices but they are awesome to cooking and it's helped me to want more fresh vegetables and fresh foods and yeah so something good has come out of this economy me cooking for myself a little bit more and my foray into fresh spices so thank you very much team me for a thousand me um, I will be back I'm trying to make a few videos so yeah thanks again bye